Gear Horror, the 80s slut. Okay, we're rolling one, two, three, action. Okay, so gear, gear horror here, and in this video, I'm just gonna do real quick and easy, man. I gotta get this shit off my chest, man. Um, I don't know, for, for uh, the people that are watching that don't know me or whatever, um, uh, I made these like gear horror videos, kind of like a joke. I was just like, fuck it, I'm me in front of the camera, and I'm going to talk about gear, because that's what I like to do, because that's what I like to do on YouTube, or I like to watch YouTube videos about gear and stuff, and um, so I was like, fuck it, I'm just going to make some videos, and I was drinking and stuff, and I just put them on, and then one of them, like, kind of kind of blew up a little bit, got like 2,500 views, so I'm really thankful for that, and uh, it was funny, because I, I kind of forgot I made the videos, to be honest, I kind of forgot I made those videos. Two weeks later, because I make a lot of videos. I don't know if you check out my channel. I have a lot of shit out there. But um, then uh, this is the point of this video, right? So I had like some like spam or some shit. And it was like, uh, like hey, check out my, my video. Like, I really like your, your video. Um, like, uh, come check out my video. So I was like, all right, that's kind of spam. But I checked it out anyway. And I don't want to put this the girl on blast, but I mean she was cute, you know what I'm saying? So I checked out her video. And I don't want to put her on blast, but it, it caught me thinking, and I was like, you know what? I gotta make this fucking video, bro. I'm gonna make this fucking video. This is like real quick, dude. I'm a little hungover, dude, but uh, I'm not gonna drink on this episode because I went out last night uh, to Sharky's. <laughs> And I had like, I don't know, three margaritas, two glasses of beer. I don't remember, but I, I walked home. It was, it was cool. And I woke up around like 7 in the morning. And I was like, fuck, I'm, I'm, got hung, I'm hungover. But anyways, whatever. I'm going to drink. I'm drinking this shit right here. This tea right here. It's called kava. I started getting this shit called kava. And it's supposed to be good for my nerves, bro. Because um, it's, it's like it tastes like shit, but... It's like a tranquilizer. So I started, I'm like, because I got this, the comments on my videos. And like, Gustavo, you're a fucking asshole. Que la chingada, you're an idiot. And I was like, damn, Cholo, I, I think I'm going to kill myself, bro. So I was having trouble sleeping. And <laughs> I was like, so I got this kava, so I'm going to drink this shit. So if I get a little loopy, oh, shit. Because you're not supposed to, oh. Because you can't really feel your mouth when you drink this shit. So if I get a little loopy on the video, whatever, fuck it. Now, um, so what's the point of the video, right? Okay, so, so I checked out the girl's video, right? And she's got, um, uh, like, two channels, I guess. And one of the channel is, like, she's got, like, tips on, like, filmmaking and stuff. And I'm like, okay, that's pretty cool, and, you know? And on the other channel, she's got, like, her videos that she makes, right? So I was checking out her, her tips video, and it was just, like, a lot of fast editing. I don't really like that shit. I'm keeping it real on these videos. You no, know, like crazy fast editing. Um, like, cause, cause this is my. If I rant, if you think I rant and shit like that, it's just me like getting like. I have a lot of thoughts in my head, so I'm just getting it out there. So you and, and you can put it together in your head. You can edit it in your fucking head. I'm not gonna do the editing. All right. So the reason I keep it raw like this is because I don't like jump cuts in the same area it it kind of it kind of like pisses me the fuck off to be honest with you because i get confused i'm like i'm like fuck man i'm watching these, these some some people have like their videos and there's like all kinds of cuts and shit and this girl's video it's like she's like uh got a lot of cuts and then the audio comes in but like she's moving around and it's like then she's saying something and it's just like dude total i'm like i'm gonna get a fucking seizure total i feel like a little kid in japan you know, watching Pokemon and shit, like, ah, like, and my eyes are like this, I can't close my fucking eyes watching her, the videos, because there's so much information, you know what I'm saying? So that's why I'm keeping it raw. But going to the fucking point here, we're gonna get there, it's a journey, alright? So, 
Jasmine. So then she has like, okay, so check out my my short film. So she's so she's at oh shit, it's working out. So she's advertising her short film, right? So I go to the fucking I, I go to this fucking short film, and and I'm watching it, and I'm like, okay, so this is her short film, right? And I'm watching it, and I was like, holy fuck. The intro was cool, but then I was like, holy fuck, Joel. it's like shaky. It's like shaky, bro. And I was like, damn, well, I know I'm not watching, like, Saving Private Ryan and shit. Like, it shouldn't be shaking like this, so maybe maybe something's going to happen or something. And no, nah, man, there's this, like, the dudes are talking, and then there's, like, really close, like, extreme close-ups, like, all kind of wide and shit. And then some other, like, that, like, real, like, and it hit me. I was like, oh, dude, she's, like, filming that shit handheld, bro. Like, it looks like, that's what it looks like. So it's like, like this and like that. And I don't want to, like, I don't want to put the troll on blast because she's doing her thing, man. But that, this is what inspired me to make this fucking video. It's what inspired me to make this fucking video. And I, and there's some other shit on YouTube that I've seen. And it's just like, you know, you know, shoot that shit. And you could use warp stabilizer and it'll like de- It'll stabilize your video and post. And, uh, and I'm thinking, I'm, I'm calculating shit in my head, right? So, the fucking film, like, fucking, you know what I'm saying? Shaky and shit. And extreme weird-ass close-ups. It's, like, almost comical, you know? Because that's, like, a com comedian uh, a cinematography co technique where they get all up close with wide angles, right? Or, or almost fisheye, you know? Almost fisheye. <laughs> So anyways, <clears throat> um, so this is the fucking point of the video. This is, I gotta take a sip of kava, dude. Hold on a second. If you're a homie out there and you're learning how to do film shit, good for you. Cause I'm, I'm, I'm with, I'm with, I'm on your side, bro. I'm on your side. I'm doing the same shit. <laughs> But it's starting to... I gotta I got get this shit off my chest, bro. Um, I think, Cholo, like... There's no reason you should be shooting shit handheld, bro. It's actually, like, really distracting to see the shaky camera shit. And it's hit me, dude. And it's because... They're shooting all gung-ho. And maybe she watched this video... Like, oh, fuck, I'll just warp stabilize it. But she didn't warp stabilize it. I don't fucking know what the hell happened. And in the comments of the videos, it was like, oh, you're doing a great job. You're doing a great job. You're doing great. And I didn't want to hate on her. It's like, hey, bitch, like, Sasuke, like, you fucked up on this goddamn... It's not... It's not... It doesn't look right. You know what I'm saying? And that's when it hit me. I'm like, you know what? This fucking bitch is lazy, bro. This fucking bitch is lazy. She doesn't want to use a fucking tripod, bro. So this is the point of the video. Use a fucking tripod and your shit won't come out fucked up. All right? <laughs> Let me take another sip of this shit. So I'm like, dude, how, how, how fucking lazy do you have to be to not use a fucking tripod, man? I mean, there's people like in Hollywood who are like paid, who are like paid to like, even if they're like with the fly cam, they're like paid, that's their job, dude. Like they look like a fucking, like they got bulletproof vests and shit and, and que la chingada and a monitor here and fucking all this fucking shit. And all they do is do fly cam. So that's the point is like, man, those guys put a lot of time and effort and money into like just getting like stable video. And this fucking lazy bitch, is doing it all like stable or fucking handheld. And I'm like, damn, Cholo, like the Cholos aren't getting this shit, man. The Cholos aren't getting this shit, man. Like, don't shoot that fucking shit handheld, bro, because that's just gonna get all shaky. And you're like, oh, well, fix it in post and warp stabilize that shit. No, 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 no. You're being fucking lazy, bro. You're being fucking lazy. And um, I kind of forgot where I was going with this, but so check this out right here. Hold on. Like, this is a fucking mini tripod right I, i'm filming this shit right now i got a field monitor i just got it and i'm testing it out and i got a lab mic right here so i'm gonna try to sync that shit and then this thing right here i i found this from videos on youtube so thank you youtube um there's this shit that it's a, a quick quick release plate 
So you get this shit like 10, 15 bucks on Amazon, you put that shit on your tripods or whatever you're using, and then you have a little plate that goes on your camera, and then uh, you put that shit on your, on your shit, and then um, you don't have to keep changing all the different kinds of release plates because everything's already, it's all good to go. So, so check this out right here, boom. This is a Manfrotto uh, MKC3H01. I'll put that shit in the whatever. And, and this is how I do quick style, right? So for all you fucking lazy motherfuckers out there, this is how you do it. So I get this shit right here, boom, 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 right? And I drop it like it's hot. I drop it like it's hot, you know what I'm saying? And then I, and then I go like this and make sure they're all good to go. And I go like this, sass, sass, you know, sass, sass, sass. I take a, I take a cigarette, and then I fucking keep doing this shit, right? Or you know, you go like, you know, what I'm saying, just do it like that, and then there you go. There's your fucking tripod right there. There's your fucking, there's a fucking tripod. And then the cool thing is this one, you can, it rolls like that. And then it locks into place, so it's kind of easy to use, right? Very intu intu intuitive, and um, I really like it, dude. And 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 it's kind of light, so check this out, bro. If you guys want to use a, a sandbag, you can get a, you get a fucking sandbag. This is a, a sandbag from Amazon. I got this shit what like six pack. I don't know. It's like I don't remember how much I paid, but then I went to Home Depot, and then I got some gravel. And I, I filled it. Because I didn't, I didn't want to use sand because I was like, well, I don't know. It was like really cheap. It was like two or five bucks for the gravel. I don't remember. I don't fucking remember the shit that I do sometimes. So anyways, so this is a tripod. And then the cool thing with this is that you can, you can um, adjust this real quick. Bam. You know, real quick. Bam. And, um. And, and the cool thing about this too is that like when I was shooting the, the first music video uh, directed by Ted McCormick, if they were here, right? Uh, we shot it in downtown LA. We just, we just drove down there. We just drove down there. And I was kind of worried because I was like, oh, fuck. Like, what if we get caught by the police, dude? We might get a, per we might get a fine for the a permit fine or something because I was reading online that... Uh, uh, that you can get a permit for that or you can you have to get a permit and it's like really expensive if they find you and they could take your gear and blah blah blah. But I was telling I called him and I was like, hey man, I don't know man, this just I don't know man. And he was like, nah fuck that shit. And I was like, alright, cool, whatever. So we went over there and and we used this tripod and I was planning on using the fly cam, but we ended up actually just using this tripod and only once or twice for like we did the handheld and it was like in the car, you know, we can't set up a fucking tripod in the car. You know, I, I have a like a little Prius, dude. It's pretty small. Prius Cholo, Prius C, because um, it's economical. <laughs> I keep it real, baby. I'm not fucking lying here. This isn't an act, bro. I don't know, man. You think I'm fucking full of shit? I'm not full. Of, I'm not full of shit. Oh, that Kava's, Kava's hitting me, guys. I just feel pretty, pretty feels pretty good I'm not gonna lie anyways whatever so this is a tripod you can use all right uh, and um, this is not a review this is not a review I'm just a, it's just me telling it like it is getting it off my chest and you can watch it if you want you know it's up to you so that's a, ah, fuck that's a fucking tripod right so this is a real and this works really well with small cameras right now i'm shooting this right now i have a bigger tripod and that so this one was like i, I think i think i think it was like 80 bucks and then the other one the other one is um uh i don't know like 300 bucks i don't remember man but it was a lot more money and apparently um from other videos that i that i watched um a good tripod costs a lot of money, right? They're like, the most important thing about fucking videos or photography is you gotta get a fucking good tripod. And I was like, all right, I took notes. I took notes on that shit. Um, and I'm like, okay, I mean, I couldn't afford like the best of the best, 
but I got something that was like muscle menos that had good reviews and stuff. Um, and it works pretty well, pretty well. Um, but it's bigger, you know, a little bit bigger. But I like this one because it's like, fuck, dude, you can just, I mean, if you're going to shoot gorilla style, might as well, you know, don't be a fucking idiot with the goddamn handheld, man. I'm telling you. All right. So let's conclude this video. Um, let's see. What do we got? What do we got? What do we got? We got the fucking tripod here. Um, I guess that's it, man. I mean, I wish... I don't know. Sometimes I think like, man, maybe I should write some jokes down and do it. But then I, and then I think of, and, and it's really funny when I think about it in my head. But then when I like write it down and try to do it, I forget what the fuck I'm saying. I forget the joke. Whatever. So fuck it, keep it raw. Gear whore, don't be fucking lazy. Use a tripod, okay? And um. Yeah, man. So salutes to the to the guys in L.A. that do the fly cam shit. Uh, and salute to the homies that are trying to do their thing. But, you know, I'm just, I'm just if you watch this video, I'm like, you know, how can I take my shit to the next level real quick? Use a fucking goddamn tripod and get a good frame on your shot, bro. That's pretty much it. Because all the other shit, like the technical fucking shit, that's important, bro. But if you can't use a goddamn tripod, I don't know what the fuck to tell you, bro. I don't know, man. All right, thanks for watching. Bye.